really windy this weekend. Yeah. I know uh, some of my neighbors maybe lost a little bit of their trash because there's several things that have blown into <laughs> my yard. Uh -huh, and that may happen again going into Wednesday. Mm -hmm. So winds were rather strong for us a Saturday afternoon. Uh, for Wednesday, they may gust over 40 to 45 miles per hour again. Goodness gracious, that's yeah. hard for drivers too on the road. It really is. Blown to the side. Yeah, especially anybody in a van or another high profile vehicle. So we'll watch for that Wednesday. Today though, mild. Okay. All right. Temperatures are going to be on the calm side for us out there with uh, a wind northeast at around five miles per hour. Let's show you what is happening at the hour. This is uh, the setup uh, for today. Mix of sun and clouds out there. Now our normal high is around 66 67 for today. We'll make it between about 55 and 60 this afternoon. Meanwhile, for tomorrow becoming milder. Now winds are okay 5 to 10 in the morning, but they'll pick up to about 10 to 15 in the afternoon and start gusting by late day tomorrow into tomorrow night. Then those winds become even stronger for us Wednesday. So a large part of Wednesday dry, but late Wednesday, Wednesday night, here comes the rain and storms into the News Channel 5 viewing area. So the overall breakdown for the day ahead will show 38 for you at 8 a.m. At noon today, 45, 3 o'clock, right around the 58 degree mark. And then by the 6 o'clock hour, we're 53. Wind northeast at about 5, sun up 639, sun down 705 as the days continue to get a little longer. Heading up to Barron Plains, Tennessee for our weather kid. This is Marcus Morris showing us 38 this morning. 58 later today. It's got that jacket on uh, for some of the, the, the coolness that we'll experience over the area for you today. 53 Cookville Crossville this afternoon. Lafayette about 52 Bowling Green 54 around 60 Waynesboro and then those temperatures hitting the upper 50s as you head back over toward the Fayetteville area. So right now not much. Some clouds, but high pressure in control of our weather. Frontal boundary down to our south becomes a warm front that will lift across the area for you tomorrow, bringing in the breezy conditions, but milder conditions as well. So no severe weather threat out there today. Tomorrow, it's back out to our west. Now, as we go into Wednesday, it does look like we'll see some strong storms, and that may prompt a Storm 5 alert. The better dynamics do, do look to, to take place uh, to the south of us as you head into Mississippi and back in the areas of Alabama, but you do see the entire area under a risk for some strong storms that risk a little stronger west of I-65. And while this does say Wednesday, keep in mind that this is actually valid through 7 a.m. on Wednesday. So for us, this is really going into Wednesday evening. So there are a look at the temperatures for you right now. Uh, that's a little warmer than we were this time yesterday. So across the Mid-South today, not a whole lot going on across the area. But here's the exact track for Wednesday, and it does show those rain cells moving in. Look at that line coming in late Wednesday into Wednesday night. In the early on Thursday, by daybreak Thursday, this is out of here, but there may still be a few left leftover showers. So if you're out and about for today, look for a high this afternoon of 58. Meanwhile, this evening here in Nashville, temperatures will be on the cool side. So if you're out and about this evening, you'll want a jacket for sure. Seven day forecast showing 78 tomorrow, 82 on Wednesday and then back into the 60s next week. Our weather artist for today is Amari Brown, a kindergartner in Miss Massey's classroom in Ida B. Wells. Our school of the day, Gamelia Elementary, where Priscilla Comer is a proud fifth grader.